Why, hello there, everyone. Welcome to What's On Saturday. Welcome to What's On Saturday. And welcome to what might be a long What's On Saturday. Because this is going to be a moment. We, Buckle her up. We have like five <laughs> P.O. Box packages to open. But since we have so many, we are going to keep them until the end. And actually, one of them is for Debbie. We are going to put below. a clip in of Debbie opening hers. She Stay is, tuned for that. She's <laughs> over the moon excited. She's so she's excited. She's so pumped. So this week covers the 5th through the 11th, and I did actually have a pretty good sales week. I had a really good sales week. I also had an amazing week in general because we went on vacation. Yes, we were gone oh, the whole time. It was so nice. We put our closets on vacation for like one day, but luckily since it was like a shorter vacation, we could get away with mm -hmm. like turning them back on before we came back. That should have affected our sales, but honestly, mine were still pretty good. My sales so, really picked up. Not too mad. Which is great. But to everyone who wished us like a happy vacation, a good vacation, we had an amazing had an amazing one. time. Oh my god. I got to unplug. I didn't really look at the computer all that much. It was great. I got maybe, some quality time up north. Maybe right over oh. us talking right now, I'll have some like clips and pictures playing of what it was like, but it was so... What we needed was a vacation that was like unplugged completely, didn't want to deal with anything. I did still edit and put up videos and we did still like do a little bit of posh, but That's for the okay. most part, we like weren't on Instagram. We weren't like like messaging around and like staring at our phones all the time so, it was, so nice. it was exactly Ugh. what the doctor ordered like, yes it was literally i was kind of having burnout low-key like before this like we've been we've been working oh we've been since working we moved hard. we have been all over the place it's pedal to the metal 100 so it was and that kind of wears you down every now and again yes. so it was nice to just like take one week-long deep breath yes. <laughs> it was great it was very much needed instead of telling you paypal sales because i did not have any and neither I didn't did ryan have any this week at all. we have two shout outs to give before we jump in to what's on saturday so first off we have a, a very special shout out to aunt leslie <laughs> so one of my very near and dear pffs her name's erin hall she's Asta lady over on instagram some of you probably know her she shot me a text and was like, oh, we were at dinner and my aunt just posh mark on the side, cute little side hustle. And she was like, do you know Jack and Ryan? And Erin was like, yeah, I met them before because we met her at Posh Fest in Phoenix. And she was just like, I just love them. <laughs> it was honestly the cutest thing ever. So Aunt Leslie, here's your big hello. Hello, Aunt Leslie. Mwah. Thank you Girlie, for watching. we love you. We appreciate it. <laughs> so much. That she is sounds, so sweet. She sounds so You sound like an sweet. amazing little person. Literally. So if I'm ever over in your neck of the woods, we're going to go to the Goodwill. We're coming. And it's going to be great. <laughs> it's going to be so we're going to go to the beach and then we're going to go to Goodwill. And then in that order. we also would like to say happy birthday happy to birthday. Emily Oliver in California. Your daughter Caroline reached out to us and she said that you watch us and you enjoy watching us. So we really wanted to say happy birthday to you and I hope you have a really great one. I hope you have an amazing day. And we appreciate you watching us. So have a little cake. Have an me. amazing. Have a little sheet cake. Have a little margarita. Yes. Have an amazing birthday. Make it a moment. She's in California. <laughs> so like it seems like with nice weather, nice beaches, oh, you have to have a nice day. Take a day off, girl. Really. Let's jump in to the sales. Like I said, this is the 5th through the 11th. First day of What's on Saturday is the 5th. And on the 5th, I matched the date and I had five sales. I had six. So my so first sale really cool. was this pair of Aritzia Babaton Dexter Jogger Pants. These got so many likes, but for some reason took like a hot minute to sell. But they finally sold for 25 and I got 20. Then I sold this The Couples White Lace Embroidered Blouse. The Couples is a very expensive brand if you ever see it. Mm -hmm. And this sold for 50 and I get 40. Love a Couples. Then I sold this pair of Ultra Core, another bolo. It's a very expensive athletic brand. Mm -hmm. Star Side Stripe High Waist Leggings. And they sold for 60, which is quite good for some leggings. Compared to the Lululemon leggings, it sold for like 30 bucks now. <laughs> Yeah. Go for the ultra course. And I get 48. Then they're back. I sold these Levi's ribcage boot cut <laughs> flare jeans and they sold for 60 and I get 48. Then to Ellie, I sold this Kate Spade Lovebird Safiano bag charm and she said she loves it. So I'm happy to hear that, Ellie. Thank you so much for your purchase. And that is it for my fifth. Okay, so my first and the fifth, Greta Van Fleet, amazing band, if you've never heard of them. Uh, graphic tee is sold for 15, I made 12. Then I sold a pair of the Levi's Free People ribcage jeans. They sold to my dear real life friend, Olivia. Olivia, I hope you enjoy them, girly. I gave them to her for 35 bucks with discount shipping. I said, here. And she said she loved them, so. 
Good job. Then I sold another pair for $55 and I made $44. You guys are going to be seeing a lot of those for like the next two weeks. <laughs> Couple <laughs> weeks probably. And then I sold another pair for $55 <laughs> and I made $44. And then I sold this Anthropology Cat Carol Adkins salad plate. Sold for $20. I made $16. I love the Anthro Cat plates. If I could have them all, I would. But I physically don't have enough cabinet space to hold all my cat dishes. Mm -hmm. So we have to unfortunately move some along. Then I sold this Coach Nomad Hobo Brown Glove Tan Leather Purse. Sold for $125. I made $100. And then that was it for my fit. So then on the sixth, I had nine sales. I only had one. I think, wow, that's strange. Yeah, you had so many more sales in the week than me. Yes. So on the sixth, actually like quite a bit of you decided to <laughs> shop my closet. So thank you, you guys everybody. so much. So first up Which was, be generous. this was not one of you guys. <laughs> but, well, I mean, unless they didn't say anything. First up was this Gap Boys skeleton foot graphic slip on sneakers. So cute. I don't skip Halloween stuff in the bins, even if it's kids. No. So these sold for 25 and I get 20 because I know there's Halloween people like me who just want stuff all year. Like I just ordered, what did I just order? Oh, a blanket, a big Halloween blanket. You bought a Halloween blanket. It was a hundred dollars. In the middle of June. And it's a hundred dollars <laughs> and it's a blanket and it's Halloween and it's June and it's like a hundred degrees outside. So. It's Oh my gosh. And I you still guys, bought it. It's so hot to the point where I don't even want to go outside anymore. <laughs> I just want to sit inside. Then I sold this Ralph Lauren vintage floral blouse. It sold for 15 and I get 12 cost me nothing. It was in the bins and it's like sheer waste. Literally nothing at all. It was just kind of cottage corey. So I was like, I'll try it. It was cute. Then Meredith. Hello, Meredith. She was so sweet. She was messaging me talking about how her and her dog love to watch us. So that is so freaking sweet. The fur babies. She got a pair of can anyone guess? The Levi's ribcage bootcut flare <laughs> jeans for 50 and I get 40 and she said they're perfect and so cute and I bet they look so cute. On her. They are really cute pair of Then jeans. Jill say. showed up. Jill, hello. Jill bought this Masoni Italian printed silk tie for her husband and she bought it for 50 and I get 40 and she said her husband does love it. So I'm happy to hear that, Jill. I'd love to hear that. Then to Kat. Hello, Kat. Kat, I know, is another Halloween lover. She didn't buy anything Halloween, but I do know that. Not this time. So is Jill, actually. So, oh, love yeah. you guys. Kat bought this Madewell gray knit duster cardigan and this Love Your Melon knit beanie for 48 and I get $35.94. Thank you, Kat. And Jill quickly turned around and came back and Thank got, God. speaking of Halloween, <laughs> this glass pumpkin handle lantern candle holder. She now has two of them that she bought for me and she's gonna set them up this October. She should send me pictures. Jill, send me pictures. Jill, show me the spooky things. Then I saw this Madewell pull on black pair of shorts to Shannon. So hello, Shannon. Shannon's Shannon. always in our premieres and she's also so sweet. so sweet. We love Shannon. And she got these for 25 and I get 17.54 and she did tell me she loves them as well. So I'm happy that you guys are liking the things you got. <laughs> and then I sold this Reformation snake print mini dress. This is super trendy, but for some reason it took a while to sell. It's kind of like those Babaton pants. They got tons of likes and tons of attention, but they just took a while. And so I finally took an offer of 55 and I get 44, even though I think I had 115 when I first got it. I Reforma said, Reformation, I think I think I'm, I'm seeing a downward I slope. I think it's like very select pieces do like much better than others. I think you others. can find it more places now. Yeah. Like back in the day, you were like, a lot. Uh, like the moment if you found it at Nordstrom Rack. Then yeah. Teresa popped into my closet Teresa. and it did a little bit of bundling. And she got this MZ Wallace Kate nylon tote along with this Levi's Nintendo Mario graphic tee, which oh, was from my own personal collection. It was so cute. And... Another item from my own personal collection, so from my closet to yours, Teresa. Brilliant. She got this vintage Levi's V logo denim jean jacket. I will put a picture also of the back of it because it had like the pocket V that Levi's have, but it was like huge on the back. It was so cool. It was really pretty. She got this all for 70 and I get 53, 54, and that's it for my sixth. Okay, my first and only on the sixth was this new tag faithful to brand Nina floral mini dress sold for $100 and I made 80. Then on the seventh, I only had one sale. I had three. My only sale was this really cute Polo Ralph Lauren color block plaid button Ooh. down. Sold for 54 and I get 40 74 I almost wanted to keep it, but I knew it would get me 
a good amount of money. Yeah. <laughs> my first on the seventh was this Brandy Melville Jean Gault Brooke tieback dress, sold for twenty minus a shipping discount. I made thirteen fifty four. Then I sold this pair of Lucky Brand black leather lattice booties for twenty. I made sixteen. Then I sold this new without tag City Chic floral V neck midi dress, sold for thirty five. I made twenty eight. And I do want to cut in here. I do apologize if our air conditioning keeps going off and on. It but is it's hundred degrees outside. It's literally triple digits, <laughs> and I'm sweating. So. So then on the eighth. I had nice. one bundle sale. I had five. My <laughs> only sale was this bundle of this Anthropology Feathers by Tolani Floral Kimono. I honestly only pick up Feathers by Tolani if it's Anthro because I don't have much luck with it otherwise. If it's in the bins, I'd totally get it though. Well, because it's silk. It's and silk weighs nothing. And it's like expensive. It's just like I usually can't sell it. And then she also got this Anthro Floral Nicru Flora. That's her name, not floral. <laughs> Anthropology <laughs> Flora Nicru. Cruise fleece embroidered pajamas set along with these anthropology high high joggers oh, those and cute. all these sold for a hundred and I get eighty. Okay, wait. My first on the eighth was oh, this. Yeah. Uh -huh. <laughs> My coffee hasn't kicked in yet. My first on the eighth was this pair of vintage Levi's, the blue denim cutoff jean shorts, sold for 20. I made 16. The George are starting to go. I got them all listed right before summer hit, and they're flying out of my closet like birds coming out of a cave. Next was this new tag Leah Sophia green cocktail ring, sold for 15. I made 12. And that went to Annie. So, Annie, I hope you enjoy it. It was really pretty. And if it would have fed on my fingers, I would have worn it. My next one was this vintage denim corduroy trim shacket. Sold for 25, I made it 20. Then I sold this Zadig and Voltaire Distressed Blue Long Sleeve. Sold for 28, I made it 2240. And then Allison came in and got a cute little bundle of this Anthropology Brown Velvet Beaded Mini Bag, Anthropology and Sanctuary Green Eyelet Jacket, and the Steve Madden Bruiser. B R E W Z Z E R. I don't know what the heck Mr. Mr. Madden's doing naming some of these shoes. Wrap slouchy brown boots. Sold for $100 and I made 80 So then on the 9th, I had two sales. I had six. So my first sale was this Wild Fox Rose Graphic Distressed Sweater. And it sold for 45 and gave me 36 I do not remember if this was a viewer, but if it is, hello, Julia. I hope you enjoy it. Hello, Julia, and thank you so much. I almost feel like I remember her saying something, but now I'm like, did she? Then my next on the... What was that? Okay, what I was saying. My next on the ninth was... There it was again. <sighs> on the ninth, my next sale was... Oh, I know what that noise was. It was this... Agua Bendita Cedro Cotton Floral Dress. Yes, why yes. I did get another Agua Bendita and I did sell it this week. And <laughs> what do you know? It flipped for quite a bit of money. I They're can't believe very it. Very expensive. Yes, yeah, so I have been like a freaking like hound, like a like, I'm like a hunting dog on these like, I, there is one that I can, like, flip, like, it's priced just cheap for an Agua Bandita, which cheap is, like, $150. I'm, like, Pew! like... He's been scouring the Snatching it like literally. a freaking, like, snake. And so I snatched this Agua Bandita Cedro Cotton Floral Dress, and it's so funny because the day that I found this and ordered it, they actually posted a picture on their Instagram of this dress. So it must be new, and actually the label inside was different. It still had the butterfly, but it was like a yellow butterfly instead of orange. We should oh, change it. She's so It was a beautiful pretty. dress though. Oh my god, it was and so pretty. And this dress sold for $365, probably a little bit less than I would have wanted, but that's so much money and I'm so excited to connect someone with the beautiful brand that is Agua Bendita. <laughs> and the Agua Bendita dealer. I'm the Agua Bendealer. Call me the Agua Bandila. I will take that. <laughs> the title. Agua Bandila. So I get 292, and I will just say, I'm not going to disclose what I spent on it, but that is still a very good profit for me. So <laughs> I will find more of them, I promise you. I literally am just like scouring like every end of the internet. I freaking love them, and they are such a like fast and huge flip. If you guys ever, ever have the opportunity to find one in like a consignment store or a thrift store, you've literally been blessed by the Agua Bendita yes, angels. The Agua Bendita fairy. Okay. Okay. 
So my first on the ninth went to Julia, and she got this super cute Elton John Rocket Man graphic tee. Sold for twenty dollars. I made sixteen, and then I sold this Urban Outfitters five panel flag hat for ten bucks. I made seven oh five, which I gave it to me. So free seven oh five in my pocket. I'm not mad. And then Renetta got this super cute champagne bottle clutch that I posted on my Instagram. <laughs> We'll put, the, we'll put the Instagram picture up here instead of the product picture. That's I cute. thought this was adorable. It was so funny. And she was like, I can't wait to use it. And I was like, I can't wait for you to use it. You're going to have a great time. So for 18, I made 14.40. And then I sold to Meredith. She got the really pretty, really fun Anya Hindmarch. Hindmarch. I still don't know how to pronounce oh. her last name. Uh, I'm not a plastic bag bag. And I don't have a picture of it, unfortunately. So do you the blank bar. Thank you, Katy Perry. <laughs> <laughs> and then I sold a five-piece bundle of a whole lot of free people. We had a little free people gay. I'll come in. She got the free people black distressed hoodie, new tag free people orange twist tank top, new tag free people black short sleeve shirt, free people black long sleeve Laguna Thermal, and the free people and Feral Robin vegan velvet wrap sandals. All of those lovely items sold for $110. She is gonna have a closet full of free people. She is, she is a free people. She point. is now a free people. Yes, she's a she free is. person. She's a free people. <laughs> Singular. Last one on the ninth. I also had a really expensive dress sale. Not as much as Mr. Jack's August Munch Meetup, but very close. The new tag ALC, the Tenley Floral Silk One Shoulder Dress, sold for two hundred and twenty-five, and I made one seventy-two fifty-five. <laughs> I just thought I edited in like the angels for Agua Medita. I could just have your ALC ride in on like a tractor. It's like they, 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 they. <laughs> No, it was a beautiful dress. No, that it was, was also, very nice. It was also in an Instagram picture. <laughs> a lot of green. Then, on the 10th, I had six sales. I had seven. My first sale was... You guys are going to get so tired of this. <laughs> Levi's Ribcage Bootcut Flare Jeans. These ones sold for 70 and I got fifty four fifty. We do have more of those left, yes. so if you want a pair, please go send me an offer. Yes. To average civilians, I sell them for 70 To you guys, I will sell them for 50 Then, I sold my very first Billy Bong. Riders of the Seas Graphic Thermal, and this is the only one I've ever picked up, because I just liked it. It had kind of, like, psychedelic, like, witchy little, like, logos on it. It's a little thing. Sold for 17 and I get thirteen sixty. Then, I sold to Julia, which, Julia. actually, Julia, I think, bought for me another time this week, and... Julia, maybe a viewer once again, maybe not. There's a lot of Julias. This was this video. that same Julia? Yeah, Julia. If you're a viewer, I love it. Hi, right, Julia. <laughs> she bought this Zara houndstooth mock smock top, mock smock, and it sold for twenty five, and I get twenty. Then this, I actually copied an old listing on Poshmark and reposted it, <laughs> which usually that. never. I don't do it often, and it doesn't work for me. Don't this <laughs> frame noir velvet shimmer tank for fifty bucks, it sold, and I get four to the very first liker on the new listing. What does noir mean? Then black. black? Yeah, noir. <laughs> then for my own personal collection, this was in an Instagram picture that I'm not gonna sell because it reminds me of winter when it was like negative 12 and I, did I say sell? Show. Show. And I don't want to think of winter. Roots. Logo. I just realized everyone bullies me when I say roots. It's roots, right? Or roots. roots. It's the long O. Or Root. does everyone make fun of me because I say roots? Roots. It's root. If you think I'm trying to say it wrong, it's because I'm a Minnesotan. So like, they got I, funky I just up here. don't say things <laughs> like roots, roots, roots. One of them, roots, roots. Logo, print, sweatpants. I'm just gonna like start butchering it on purpose. <laughs> roots. Sold for twenty five, and I get twenty. So thank How do you, you pronounce thank it? you Canada for those do you roots. Do the the dip in the roots, or do you do roots? I just remember when I said it last time. There were like 12 comments that were like, what did you do? <laughs> and I was like, I didn't do that on purpose. Like, jeez. Everybody be nice. <laughs> I hear people say, in Minnesota, some people say roots and some people say roots. In and Des Moines, like, it's roots. Yeah. Well, like, to me, roots. it's like, it's tree roots and it's like family roots, kind of. Oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> you know what? That's okay. I'm not here to be a linguist. Then, last on the 10th, went to... Betsy. Hello, Betsy. She bought this Fabletics black hoodie dress and this Chaser Star Print graphic sweatshirt, which is so freaking cute. Love me a good Chaser graphic And together, sweatshirt. I sent her an offer of 52 with discount shipping, and I get 39.14, so thank you, Betsy. Thanks, Betsy. <laughs> okay, my first on the 10th was a three-piece bundle. First, it's Apology Maeve Jamie Wide Leg Jumpsuit, another one of those pairs of the Levi's Ribcage Boot, and an ASOS Miss Selfridge gray flounce sleeveless dress. 
Sold for 115, I make 92. My next on the 10th was literally the cutest pair of vintage shorts I've ever seen in my entire life. Vintage high rise floral embroidered denim shorts, sold for 30, I made 24. And then little Miss Galama said that I need that coach purse from that haul that you did a couple mm -hmm. of days ago. I need that. Not she done got it. So she got the, it says custom listing for Grandma, but it was the Coach Willis satchel and that really pretty like oxblood color. I've never seen one in that before. Glamma is a coach queen. She, made, the Made in New York coach, she's like a moth of the fly. She moth, she's like me with agua. That's Glamma with like Made in USA Not coach. moth of the fly. Moth of the flame. Yeah. Here we moth go. of the fly? Anyway, I'm sorry. <laughs> so I gave it to her for 30 bucks and I made 24. Glamour is the moth to the fly. Uh, it's early and it's also the weekend. We need to make her one custom piece of merch that just says the moth to the fly. It's like she, her t-shirt says moth and her husband's t-shirt says the fly. Moth to the fly. Anyway, think about it. Okay, my next on the 10th went to Jessie and she got this super cute bundle of this pretty little thing. Striped linen <laughs> blend tie crop top. I have never, ever, ever sourced a pretty little thing out of at all except um i found this one at a plato's closet half off sale and it was very inexpensive i thought it was cute and then she got i'm saying pretty little fine pretty it's kind of like that tiger mist brand where it's like a cheaper like instagram brand but like mm -hmm. it still makes very trendy stuff yes, they do. then she got this abercrombie white gold floral sequin kimono also from that vince hall i gave them to her for 40 big ones and i make 32 and that was it in my town on the 11th the final day of what's on saturday i had two sales i had five my first sale was another ralph lauren which wow two in a week <laughs> ralph lauren you also know it's ralph lauren ralph it's just more yes. fun to say ralph lauren ralph lauren r l y c striped button shirt and all of you guys taught me that that means ralph lauren yacht club which I did not know. Good to know. So thank you guys for teaching me. We teach you, you teach us. It's, it's a like, mutual thing. It is. It's okay. <laughs> Knowledge is circular. <laughs> this sold for 30, not as much as the other because it wasn't as interesting and I get 24. And my last sale of the week, I feel like Ryan, I sold this Urban Outfitters Coincidence and Chance Eagle Graphic Sweater and it sold for 25 and I get 17.54. So my first on the 11th was the Smartwool Teal Quarter Zip Long Sleeve, sold for 38. I made 30, 40. Smartwool, love. Love it. Always have, always well. You can even tell with holes. This mm -hmm. one, thankfully, didn't have any. And then Tiffany, which is funny. I don't know if this is the same Tiffany, but I went to grade school with a woman named Tiffany with the same last name, but I'm not gonna say it. And I wonder if it's you. So if, Tiffany, if we went to second grade together, you call me, <laughs> hi girly. Her mom is also so pretty, oh my God. She got this 413 NNA, don't know how to say that brand, <laughs> puff sleeve oh. polka dot crop top, vintage Southern Comfort Y2K, red cami, vintage Oshkosh Bagash, red corduroy overalls. Oh my, Oshkosh Bagash. So cute, literally so cute. And then she got this guest blue, yellow 90s striped t-shirt bundle sold for 115 and I made 92 bucks again. And then Reese, I don't know if that's how I'm saying your name right. She is Simply Petites over Richie? on Poshmark. R-I-C-C-I. -C -C Richie? Richie? Reese? I'm sorry. Simply Petites on the Poshmark app. Such a sweet little lady. She got this Madewell Floral V-neck shirt sleeve floral top and this Zara Grave Micro Plaid mini dress sold for 43. I made 34 40. And then I sold a pair of Sebeka brown leather woven Hirachi sandals. These are really popular. I pick them up in the bins if I've already seen them. Those like kind of, I think I'll call them grandma sandals, but they're popular. They got the like woven thing in them. You can see what they look like. So for 28, I made 22.40. And my last, because I could not go a week without selling an Urban Outfitters piece. Urban Outfitters BDG Dark Wash Cheeky High Rise Denim Shorts. Sold for 28, I made 22.40. My gross for the week was 1,442. Mine was 1,663. Oh, I oh, beat you I this week. Then. Wow. And my was 1,138 and 60 cents. Mine was 1,315 and 56 cents. So even if I hadn't had my agua, that honestly wasn't that bad of a week. No, I had an amazing week yes. this week. It was great. And I gotta pay taxes next week, so yay. Yeah, really. Pay your quarterly taxes. Time for the fun part. <gasps> All right, time for <sighs> prisons. That was a good one from Saturday day. I'm ready to open some gifts. Time for prisons, 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 prisons. It feels like Christmas <laughs> every time I get to do this, and I love it. It does. I absolutely do. Should we start with smallest first? I okay, we so we actually, we left it for the end this time, like we said in the beginning, 
thing because we have like five of them because we were gone for a whole week and we didn't check for last week. But we're gonna jump into them. Sorry. Glamma sent one for Debbie. So, so we're gonna we'll when we get when we get to Glamma also sent she sent two because she's just so nice. She's an icon. Once we do the one that we got from her, we will cut to the clip of Debbie finally opening. <sighs> Debbie's her. out with her gal pals today. She has also been talking about it for so long. She has. So long. She's been so excited. Every time we go to the PO box, she's like, is she's my like, present here did yet? my fans send me a present? And we're like, no, Debbie, it's not here yet. And she goes, okay. <laughs> First up is from and from Oregon. So hello. Oregon, an Oregonian. Of course, we have a card. Let's look Cute. at the card, but we will not disclose what the cards say because sometimes they're personal. I will disclose how cute it is. Okay, though. it's a cute card though. <laughs> it's adorable. That looks like Debbie's dog. That looks like Misty. Misty. Jabba. <laughs> We're gonna read the card. Actually, this individual told us not to mention their name. This is why I don't read the cards either, because like sometimes people <laughs> want like things this. to be kept on yeah. the DL. So if it seems like I just chopped out a name, I should just- We absolutely it. did. We did. But that's okay. So we received from this individual. This lovely this, person. Whatever floats your goat. And it's a little like, oh, it's, <laughs> it's a cute. gift, it's a gift bag. So it's, it's a cute. gift bag. I like the little small one. I've never seen them that Open tiny for before. sound. God. What's in it? Oh my gosh! You're absolutely kidding me. You're absolutely kidding me. Oh my gosh! They sent us a Gucci ring. <laughs> this is an Stop it. This is an Stop authentic it. Gucci ring. You oh, did not. Fits. Okay, good. I have too many. So this one's gonna go to Jack. You're absolutely oh, freaking kidding Oh my me. gosh. Okay. Luckily, even though we can't say this person's name, they did include we their got the Instagram. Instagram handle. I'm coming for you. Oh literally. my gosh. Guys. You people are ridiculous. Can this is it? so, and it's, hold on. I've never actually so, seen Gucci jewelry. In now we know how to authenticate, except you guys can't see it. But it says Gucci made in Italy on the inside. Oh my God. What? Oh my god, it's absolutely beautiful. Oh my it's really good with my engagement ring. Really you thank you. To this person. I am absolutely blown kidding. away. I have wanted a Gucci ring. I don't wear a ton of jewelry, but I have wanted a Gucci ring so freaking bad for so long. Yeah, when, can we do that? My only two jewelry wish list items are a Gucci ring it's and so the Alexander pretty. McQueen skull bangle. This is insane. This is- You're going to be getting a DM. Right out of the gate, you I'm going to send you a coffee. <laughs> this is ridiculous. This is crazy. I proposed to Ryan, so I got him an engagement ring. This one. And I was always like, you should just get me like a Gucci one to put like as a placeholder. I was gonna. Well, this person did. Don't so. need you now, thanks. <laughs> I'm engaged to someone else now. That is crazy. I'm bestowed to another. I feel me. awful. <laughs> That's insane. And it's so pretty. I'm never taking that off, ever. No, and you don't need to because it's good silver. That's... Okay. <laughs> and that was the first one. That's out of the gate. That's a what? lot. Very much appreciated. Also, I don't deserve that. But thank no. you. Jack doesn't deserve it. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Thanks, Ryan. No, I'm this one is from Allison. Allison sent me um, the Eunice sweater that I lusted and dreamed over since I was in middle school. So yes. if she makes me cry again, I'm going to be upset. Allison is the one that sent me that amazing skeleton like black as my soul oh, coffee yeah. sweatshirt and she sent the skull crystal vodka like little containers oh, with the that I've wanted forever. So Allison's a homegirl. Allison's I amazing. love Allison. And the the card is reminds me of Limited too. It looks like I love Delia's or something. It does look like a Delia's card. Okay. Private card time. Aw. She's also like okay. the number one she's cheerleader. She's such a little sweetheart. So I love sweet. her. She was telling us how excited she is about Full Card Club and that she sent us some shirts that she hopes we like and that <sighs> she hopes they make us smile like we make her smile, which is so sweet. She's literally so nice. So Allison. nice. Okay, right out of the gate. We love. Perfect. We stand Perfect. the Taco Bell merch. T-shirt number one. I love t-shirts, if you can't tell. <gasps> oh, wait, hadn't she sent us a picture of this? What does it say? Senorita, I'm talking. I'm thinking. 
<laughs> you, me, Taco Bell. Oh. Wait, how old is this? 1998. This t-shirt is as old as I am. Yo quiero Taco Bell. Remember, I remember the that. little Yo Taco Bell. the commercials with the Chihuahua? I remember him. And I used to have the little stuffed animal that like you could oh squeeze him and he'd say, Yo quiero, Yo quiero Taco, Taco Bell. Taco Bell. Oh my that is gosh. That's so funny. We're gonna have to try to share this. This <gasps> one is a hot sauce packet. <gasps> That's Border so sauce, cute. hot sauce. I don't think it's better from here. Taco Bell. Live Moss. That is so That looks cute. like something that Urban Outfit Oh my god, now. you're kidding me. Oh, I'm gonna wear the crap out of this. It also messes the t-shirt I have now. So. Okay, so <gasps> this is gonna be Ryan's. Oh my god, Because wait. he freaking loves... Sherm is it a Shamrock Shake Yes, it's a Shamrock Shake. I love this. What does it oh, say? Oh, I love that. Cool, minty, and full of luck. Oh my gosh, these are so cool. Okay, but that's adorable. Also, like, um, Ali, the spots, like, add to the character. I so, also, I love a good t-shirt with a spot on it. I really do. So this, I'm gonna take from you. <gasps> For many reasons. It says, gone squatching. <laughs> when I was a kid, all I watched was Sasquatch Hunters. Like, I had the trucker hat. I had everything. I love this. When we were up north in northern Minnesota, Big this last... Tommy, but nobody believes you. This, this last week, <laughs> we found out that, like, apparently so Bigfoot's cute. supposed to live in northern Minnesota. So I guess we gotta go squatching at some point. I gotta go squatch. Which... I'm ready to go. Are you kidding me? I'm ready to go find me okay. a Bigfoot. Well, I'm gonna hoard this one This is amazing. This is... I think this is more fitting for you. Oh, this is me. Yeah. Allie, thank you so much. Girl, you've done it again. You You're so nice. You know us so more than I know well. Me. Like, it's weird it's how so you know me and know the things I like more than my family members. <laughs> now I can walk in and pretend I'm an employee and go back in the kitchen and just take it. And just get free food. <laughs> like, oh, I'm clocking in jury. Give me a minute. This is from Laura. Oh. Hopefully we don't have to cut out Laura's name, but if we do, Laura, we'll go back in this video and we'll edit your name out. Card first from the Leaning Tree. Debbie would love this. All this purple. <laughs> name. Debbie loves purple. Time for the card. It's a Laurel Birch card. I love Laurel Birch. Ugh. So Laura wrote us a really sweet, nice note and she said that these are all thrifted. That's right up our alley. So I'm very excited to see what oh, they are. It. Also, she asked if I like macrame plant holders. The like answer to holders. that question, Miss Ma'am, is a resounding yes. Yes. I love them. Okay, so let's get into <laughs> item number one. And here she is, oh, right here. Oh, it's a macrame pot hanger. Ooh. Oh, these are staying in the house. Are you kidding me? I'm gonna hang these on Debbie's dick. <laughs> They're adorable. Cute. Oh, I love I these. I love these like bead beads. details and stuff. We'll figure that out. But how pretty is this? With this big old ring on it? I love them. Ooh. Oh, this is a big one. How cute is this? Oh my gosh. These are like nice. Oh, ones. I love these with these. Oh, and this is wood too. Pot goes in here. I have some plants that like the shade. Perfect. Hang them under the deck. I'm and these so are excited. so pretty. These are so fun. Ooh. Oh, this one's definitely. This one my has favorite. lucite. This is so pretty. Right? Is this lucite? Is it glass? I, I think, think so. Or just plastic. Glass. Whatever it is. It's Ooh. so pretty. Oh my gosh. These are like. Oh, this is for a big one. I. I love this. Love one. these. They look like like amber almost. These are so. Does she know that you like? I think so. So this is a Laurel Birch. <laughs> Ryan loves cat Laurel Birch. Stuff. I'm thinking of, I have a cat tattoo. This one and some are good. So I'm thinking I'm gonna get it redone and have it be like Laurel Birch themed. I'm obsessed with this. Oh, this stuff is so cute. Ooh, that's oh my gosh, so, this pretty. Is so pretty. Leonard. This is really pretty. I love the colors. I know. And the berries. That's really It must pretty. be expensive. I just must not know what I'm talking I about. It must be like a vintage. And then this we I love have... for you because you're gonna love it. I know. I saw this. Oh, I know what this is. And I am 100% gonna put the crap out of it. It is a Laurel Birch t shirt. I feel like you're gonna wear this like continuously. Oh, I 100% am. I 100% am. I love wearing purple and I love this and it fits so my cute. 80s mom aesthetic. That's so funny. Literally, Ryan has been nonstop talking about how he's gonna get his tattoo turned into Laurel Birch art. So like literally, she Plus must she, she must be in our like Alexa or something. Can you imagine me on casual Friday walking into the classroom? I picture Laura sitting at home listening to her like our Google Home. She's like, oh, Laurel Birch. Okay. I hope so. Laura, <laughs> girl, if you got my wires tapped, you did an amazing job. <laughs> Thank you, Thank so, you so much, much Laura. Laura. These that are so sweet. cute. Let's dive into Glamour. We got a Glamour pucker. So we're gonna do the one that's addressed to the two of us, and then we're gonna cut to the one for Debbie. Miss Debu. I mean, it says Jack and Debbie and Mike. So I'm thinking that's the one for Debbie. <laughs> but this one just says Jack and Ryan. <laughs> Is this glass? Oh no. Why am I, you're daring. I see, I see a little, is this a heel? Oh, it's a cookie cutter. I think, maybe. <gasps> I know what this is. Wait, open it, open it, open it, open it. I know what this is. I talked to Glamour on the phone one time <laughs> and I know what this is. Oh my gosh. Okay, so you can't see this. Do I have something to like put this behind? It says Jack and Ryan. Oh, you guys can't see it. 
Oh wait, there it goes. It's etched in Jack and Ryan, and it's a sign for our wedding. And it lights up. Oh, wait, here, there's an outlet. Oh, we don't have a plug-in. It a needs USB. a USB. Shoot. This is so Mama. cute. I believe her brother-in-law makes these, made this. I do not, I don't think she even told me his name. But Glamma, tell him thank you. This is, this is so, so nice. This is 100% going up on like <gasps> the guest table at our wedding. Oh, 100%. 100%. Oh, that is so I'm cute. so sad you guys can't see it, but it says, it says Jack plus Ryan. It's like etched. Yeah. We'll take a picture of it when it's all lit up and we'll put it in here. <gasps> I love this. Are Glamma, you you're me? so sweet. Your brother-in-law is so sweet. I was gonna say, a whole dang family. Love him to death. Look at how freaking cute this is. This is the light that Glamma and her brother-in-law sent, and it changes colors. It's so sweet. This is not all that Glamma gave, because Glamma just never stops being amazing. No. So she's the gift that never stops giving. So and let's cut. Let's it. cut to Debbie. Debbie's gonna be pumped. <laughs> Take it away, Debbie. So first up, we totally forgot that we also got two two, cards. two cards in our PO box, yes. not just packages. They're very sweet. So we got um, from Cat Cram. She sent us a very nice note. Thank you, Catherine, and um, a very nice Visa gift card. <laughs> We are she always is helping out with our house, put in our house fund, our house fund. <laughs> which is great. And she sends us the sweetest card. She's so nice. And then Glamma sent us this amazing card. And we got a Home Goods gift card and a Panera gift card, which is good because I need to eat healthier. Glamma is the gift <laughs> that just keeps on giving. <laughs> She's so sweet. And speaking so, of Glamma, the moment has come that we've all waited for. Here we go. Oh, I almost tripped. Debbie. Comment on the household thing, but. You're in my household, so why are you guys getting household stuff? Future household. Oh, the house, the right. house. Debbie, Yeah, we're okay, gonna blink an eye. the household of the present? Yes. <laughs> we're gonna blink an eye and the home goods <laughs> gift card will just be in Debbie's back Probably. pocket. But isn't it to Mike too? Well, no, that's, that's Misty. Missy. No, I know, but I mean, Mike was right here. Michael, come here. <laughs> The label says Jack, mm, Debbie, mm, Mike, but we're gonna let Debbie open it because it's I've probably never made. Gotten a present. She's well, I so have excited. gotten some hug butt coasters and they're yes, beautiful. From Ray. I've never gotten okay, a present. Right. She's saying. Oh, well, I mean, maybe things. there's been a birthday or a Christmas, but okay, Ryan and Jack. Okay. Okay. Queen Deb. Queen, Queen Deb, Deb and Mike. And Mike. Oh, yeah. Michael, look at, we got something. Let's see what's in here. Mm. <laughs> it's not edible. What a bummer. Here's Misty, or as Jack and Ryan call her Jabba the Hutt. She very much is, yeah. Oh, I'm, oh no. This is probably the one for me. <laughs> How did she get? How did she Just know you're size. an extra, 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 extra small? Aww. Thank you. You're not gonna read it? <laughs> Let's see. All for love, love for all. Aww. Michael yeah. has his pride outfit. Yes, yes he does. Mike already has a little like tag too for pride. So yeah. good for Mike. It would not fit Misty, no. as you can see. <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh, I can already see what this says. Oh, Let's boy. see. I pride Aww. part my gay son. <laughs> Look at it. I did not oh, know Glamo was sending that. Oh my gosh. Now this one will fit me. <laughs> I love that. That's so oh, cute. Thank you. Oh my god. She goes by Glamma. Like oh. Grandma and Glamorous. Glamma. Thank you, Dana Glamma. <laughs> hey Ryan, go it. look at ours. Okay, let's do these two. Let's oh, say. this is actually really cute. Oh. It's a Love is Love t-shirt. I love that font. Did she custom order oh. all these or something? I don't know. Who's this from? Oh, it's an Urban Outfitters t-shirt. Oh, oh this cool. Is soft. Oh, I love this. She said, this Jack, looks like a it's for me. Skull scarf. Cute. There it goes. Oh, pretty. Thank you, Glamma. Thank you, Glamma, as always. Look Thank you, Glamma. <laughs> it fits. And then Ryan can just add an in-law <laughs> I was gonna say sticker to it. And then it can be Sun for- and son-in-law yes. yeah <laughs> perfect so thank you to all of you that watched of course we really appreciate you guys Everybody watching that made it to the end of the video if you're still here you know what to do if you're still here you really know what to do we might need to upgrade the number this time <laughs> wow we gotta kick it up a notch. <laughs> so thank you guys for watching let us know how your sales week was as always i hope it was super super good and to all of our very special friends that sent us presents and gifts. You guys are too nice to us. Oh my gosh. Me. This is like something I thought I'd never own in my life. 
and it just to, sent to, to us the, the individual that sent it to me from so, a lovely human being. This is you guys are so amazing. You guys are so sweet. Like, I can't even. Ryan loves Laurel Birch. I Mac love me some. Hangers. I love me some plant hangers. Now we finally have our first piece of decor for our wedding because we're like low key a little behind. <laughs> I'm not like I'm planning it. Planning it. We These have vintage, vintage Taco shirts. Bell merch. Oh my gosh! The Thank moment. I'm so she excited. is the moment. You guys are like so sweet. You always literally outdo yourself. And again, never feel like you have to send us no. anything ever, mm -mm. ever, ever, ever. We love you all, like no matter what. So. Thank you guys so much for watching. We will see you on Tuesday, Tuesday for possibly a haul because we are planning on going to the bins. Yes, we are. But we'll see if the bins are kind of a train wreck like last time. <laughs> Fingers crossed once again that they're not. Hoping they not. Yes. So thank you, everyone. And we will see you on Tuesday. Bye. Goodbye.